Fuck, you're right. Okay, so this is going to be a slightly shorter stream of this because I started a bit late tonight and went a little bit longer with Astroneer, but um, next time I stream it, I'll give it the full attention because this, this game ended up being really good. If you don't know what the fuck this is, I don't know if I can explain it. Just look at the feet and the hot dog. And Here lies April. Yeah. So last time I played this, um, we downloaded a game that overloaded the computer for a couple of weeks, and now we have to clean up Hypnospace because it's a big fucking mess. Mass cleanup for all enforcers. So that means we have to, um, we just have to look around. Incident of Cool Fest 99. Barnaby's chair. Bottleby's lumpkin. Click the monkey below to listen and read the lyrics to Satellite Orchestra. Hmm. Alright, go for it. I don't know if this is copyright infringement. Back when we was young and pretty. Back when we were both young and pretty. Oh, you had so much to say. Don't bother. The dumpster told you. Okay. The dumpster. 69 years old again, huh? Homepage of Dylan Merchant. Oh, hey, Dylan, you're looking pretty cool. There's a lot of reading in this game, and I will eventually get to some of the reading, but... Now, this page is totally empty, as far as I can tell. Aldrin's House of Sound. Under construction, we're changing to a digital format. Aldrin's House of Sound Online. Hey, music lovers. Bill Aldrin here. Welcoming you to the new Hypnospace version of Aldrin's House of Sound. You may be familiar with my magazine if you're from... Ojai area. Is there a goal in this game? Yeah, you have to clean up the internet. You're a cop. You're an internet cop. Yeah. Music reviews and stuff. And then there's, um, Hypno OS Tech Tips here. Well, I just don't feel like reading every single thing on every page. Not right now, if ever. Um, maybe the more interesting pages. It's because it's just, there's so much. Someone said here, I think the most annoying thing about Vinny is how much he hates reading. Reading hard, wah. Wow. I love reading. Maybe you don't know that much about me. 
but reading is so hard. Do you want to read another neurally generated internet story from Lord of the Rings? No, um, you know, I just, I have to read all this out loud. It's like, you know, not really. Some of it, sure. You know, I'm gonna have to read all of... It can get exhausting, but when I stream Final Fantasy IX, I'm gonna read all of that out loud, and I'm gonna have to kind of put some emotion into the script as well. So yeah, yeah, it's something that I have to be mentally prepared for. And I do have a sore throat at the moment. In my... in my defense. This is very useful if you want to keep a program visible while using one of HypnoSS oh. other programs like HypnoSpace Explorer or Inbox. Note, only some programs are pinnable. Hover your cursor next to the X button to check. Well, there you go. Get the computer to read it for you. Using... Okay, this is... If you want to keep a program visible... Is that right? So... Using stickers on your desktop. Ever wonder what that big orange button does? Click it. It will place a copy of the image on your desktop background. Oh, I know about that you one. Can even move, resize, and rotate it. Imagine using your mouse scroll hey, stop. to move any stamped images over or under one stop. another. Stop. Use this to decorate your desktop how you like. Mm. My desktop doesn't usually have this many stickers on it. So Just we did sticky notes already. Stickers can do. Page loading speed. Wiggle your mouse cursor wildly. No joke. Wildly moving the cursor around will increase both download and processing speed in Hypno S. Oh, that the robot head lad stops it. Okay. Working on a book about Hypno OS. In the meantime, check out my WITW page. Oh, wow. Um... You, here's here's how you get your porn name and a password. It's your mother's maiden name mixed with the name of your first pet. That's how you get a good password, everybody. No, I'm not telling you mine. But let's just say Mr. Snake is a good first name for a porn star. Okay. Get okay, back to the cafe. Jazz's software reviews. JAS here. By day I'm a software engineer and a boring company. God, the internet has changed. The hypno space has changed so much. It is my mission to review software, both free and paid, amateur and pro, for the benefit of my lovely readers. If I'm missing anything, please chit chat me and I'll review it as soon as possible. Note. I don't cover profane or pornographic material. Okay. I guess, um, you don't want Granny Cream then. Janitor game, not sure what it is, but I think this might be illegal. It does allow you to score easily, easy hypno coin, but I deleted it because I don't want to implicate myself in crimes. Soundscapes. Are you a democratic socialist? in or around Akron, Ohio. If so, chit-chat me, because I'm moving there soon. I'd love to get a little group together. Oh. Politics has entered the stream. Politics has left the stream. This program is pure junk. What, Professor Helper? Doesn't even tell. Coward. It's designed to fool naive citizens into downloading it, and then shows them ad after ad after ad. Said ads are all tied to some sort of weird payment system. Avoid this program. Zero slash five shells. April Virtual Pet. April is the first of many virtual pets planned for release by Merchant Soft itself. 
Merchant Soft's pets are a pet project, haha, of Dylan Merchant, the younger of the Merchant brothers. One begins to wonder if they're spending more time on this than on fixing the many bugs that plague Hypnospace. I digress. Is there a way to just lower the music? Your pet with angel wings. You're charged with making sure that April stays happy and healthy by petting, feeding, and cleaning up after her. Not my cup of tea, but younger audiences will love it. Three fifths shells. Hypnospace is great. Hypnospace is great. Faster would be good. Hypnospace is great. Hypnospace is great. Hypnospace is great. Hypnospace is great. I like the music, but yeah, just, just a little bit. A little bit less would be nice. Dragon adopted from Phaedrilla. I'm naming mine Kenny. He likes corn dogs. Burnt. <laughs> okay. That's cool. Um, You wouldn't happen to have any malware on your website, huh? Mm, anything illegal? No. Alright, citizen. Reggie Paul's home. This is a safe page. I am beef brain shield protected. News. I am now a subscriber on Hypnospace. Yippee. No more free trial for me. Hey y'all. It's Reggie here. I'm finally on this thing. Not an Amish guy anymore I guess so now my kids can't make fun of me. If you don't know me, I am happily married to Shelly and we have three beautiful children. Until later. Huh. Okay. I am not a communist but I have to <laughs> apologize for the accusatory words I made last time. I guess you shouldn't judge people before meeting them. Stop sending money one is a good man. This brain protected by Beef Brain Shield Pro. The fuck? What if I told you that Merchant Soft has a dirty little secret? I'm telling you now it's true. The Hypnospace headband has been found to cause Beef Brain! A disease that is baffling doctors and sending regulars Regulators knocking at Merchant Soft's door. If not dealt with, beef brain can cause exhaustion, extreme headaches, and even death. To form hypnospaces, images and sounds, radiated electrons are beamed into your frontal and sidial lobe lobes. When very bright colors are transmitted, the extreme radiation literally cooks your brain. That's right, hypnospace is cooking your brain. This is it on drugs. Until Merchant Soft fixes it. Or are shut down by the feds, it is very dangerous to browse Hypnospace. But we have a solution. Our team of scientists and engineers have conducted over 1 million medical science experiments which have resulted in the ultimate solution. I don't know, this kind of seems like... kind of seems like crap. By adding... By adding the Beef Brain Shield Pro Edition Reduction sidebars to your page, you can reduce your risk of Beef Brain by over 800%. And the best news... Beef Brain Shield Pro is completely free. Download your sidebars today and get this official badge to let page visitors know that you're protected. I'm gonna have to check out that program. I'm also gonna make the game's volume louder overall. Just lower the music a bit. That way the, the text is a bit louder. Brain Shield Pro Redition Reduction Sidebars to your page. A little bit better. You reduce your risk of beef brain by over 800%. The text is now louder, everybody. And the best news. Beef Brain Shield Pro is completely free. Download your sidebars today and get this official badge to let page visitors know that. Downloading Beef Shield Side, Beef Shield Batch. Downloading four files. I want to be protected. Protect me. Did I download, like, four of these? So it's just pictures. I mean, I could still try to, like, because there's 
possibly misinformation here. Propagation, um, um, malicious software, um, I don't know. Yeah, it doesn't seem like Beef Brain is all that bad. It's not malware. It's just some dopey, like, dumbass. Um, who, who, and you just download pictures. It's fine. The one guy talking about passwords disclosed sensitive personal information. I don't know, that's a bit of a stretch. I think he was just talking about, like, making your password strong. Did this site, like, not load fully? Vinny, he gave you his password. Well, well, hang on a minute. Let's take a look. Picking a secure password. Use personal information. Use personal information that only you know. This is personally, huh? My favorite method. A great example might be. So if you live in Denver, you're 29, and your favorite hobby is computers, wow, mine too, your password <laughs> would look like this. Well, he's 49, so this... I don't know. Violation. No, it says he's 49 over here, so even if it is 1999, you know, it still says that. Um, yeah, I, I, this, this citizen is fine. Samantha C's page. I'm a programmer working at Merchant Soft. New update, November 7th, 1999. Wow, this job is keeping me busy. They're doing some exciting things here, and it's hard not to get caught up in all the excitement. It's exhausting. In a good way, of course. My time here is split between fixing bugs and working on the year 2000 update. With less than two months to go, I'm not sure how we're going to finish it all. I sense that this is normal for the tech world, so I'm sure it's just me being new. Till next time. I don't know how, um, how true this is. But again, I can't really... Hazopedia is a small project I'm working on with... Fellow music snobs, it's a friendly alternative to Slushmouth's guide. I don't know, these people seem fine. This is the dude from earlier. Millennial Anthem. Ice cream and booze. These are literally your bosses. Dylan's the CEO of your company. Likes programming. Listening to people acquired rock slash dirt haze slash cosmic music. Chocolate ice cream. Dirt haze. Only Fuck chocolate. yeah. Science Legally acquired rocks. Books. Fuck Mac yeah. Cheese. Women. Philosophy. Dislikes. Artificial boundaries. Black licorice. Smooth jazz. Mindless drones. If you follow tech news, you've probably heard of my brother Adrian and I. I'm the creative one and Adrian is the business one. Can't argue there. I'm definitely the fun half of the this equation. This guy's a stud. Winky face. Gonna get him- that Gonna get himself like this. some Only legally acquired music and women. Good for him. Tons of cash. Legally Adrian acquired, of Edison. course, women I'm and music. Or something like that. Basically what I'm saying here is I'm the one with the talent and Adrian is a balding stiff who knows how to make a deal or two. He's well aware of this dynamic and has made peace with it. P. Big. P. In all seriousness, Adrian is a great guy and I'm fortunate to have him as a brother. Oh, okay, well Dash, that's better. Slash, slash. Dash, slash, slash. This is really good. The robot is, is very helpful for me tonight. Hey, Mono, what was the song that was claimed? Was it Tamara's page?
faraway beaches, calming eastern temples, and even fantastic aliens. The I Choose song? Yeah, I'll, I'll be stopping that one. ...produces sounds by utilizing advanced algorithms, fine-tuned to the intricacies of the human ear. Wait, randomly generated Normally music? Soundscape setup. These no SCG soundscapes generate sound... Please note, SCG soundscapes dynamically generate based on sound dynamically hypnosis. based on your hypnosis input. After turning soundscapes on, you may not hear much initially. This is normal. Minimize soundscapes as you continue to use Hypno S. Whoa. Warble intensity. <laughs> Next red box right here. Downloading SCG underscore secret forest. Just making some weird wobbly noises and stuff. There it is. Whoa. Technology is so cool. Howard's life tricks. Please stop sending me hypno coins. Stop sending money. Don't Nate. Hi hypno space citizens. In case it wasn't obvious, my name is a joke. Please stop sending me hypno coins one at a time because my message inbox keeps filling up and it is very hard to read. If you were doing this to be nice, thank you, but please stop. If it's some kind of practical joke, it is not funny. Now back to our regularly scheduled programming. Please enjoy these life tricks I picked up in my short 47 years on this planet. I can relate to this dude. Cooking trick number one, ever short on time but want scrambled eggs. Worry not. Throw one or two eggs in a microwavable bowl, add a tablespoon or so of milk, and mix with a fork. Put your microwave on medium power and heat for one to two minutes. Keep an eye on them so they don't explode. Cooking trick number two, buy frozen dinners. BWL. Camping trick number one. When you first arrive at the park, look at all the other empty campsites to see if they have any leftover wood. Does that work? Sometimes you won't even need to buy any. Camping trick number two, meet your camp neighbors as soon as possible. Not only is this just a nice thing to do, but it helps to know the people who are soon going to catch you being in the woods. Hmm. Family trick number one, talk to your family. I know it sounds simple, but it was hard for me to learn. I always wanted them to call me first while they were waiting for me to make the first move. This is a ridiculous game. Just call. I don't know, how much time does it take to fucking fry up some scrambled eggs? Just throw a little bit of butter in there? Office trick number one. Do you work in an office where they make you work unreasonably long hours, or ask you to risk your health for Gotta clean the pan though. Task? Yeah, I guess you're right. Consider forming a union. There's a neat group in Hypnospace called the Workers' Alternative to learn more about this kind of thing. Yunyun. Yeah, that song gets claimed on YouTube. So, <laughs> no thanks. Welcome to the homepage of sound artist, interpretive dancer and poet Tamira Frost. Have a seat. Downloading Tamira underscore Icos. So far, no illegal citizens. I haven't seen anything scummy. Music file added to 
box library. Oh, I can't. Right, I can't play that. That's right. Time to have um when I'm a scared, computer and read late poetry. Night, and I imagine moving shadows and sharp teeth glinting and rustling dangerous feet. I close my eyes. I listen for the thing I fear. The tingle on my spine and the back of my hands and the curl in tingle? my feet. Waves on my shore, a shore that does not break. Listen. Listen. Curl tighter. Keep my eyes closed. Listen. Here it comes. Reach out. Quickly now. Quickly now. Grab <laughs> hand. I got it. I open my eyes. I open my hand. All I hold is moonlight, and a nightmare that does not exist. I let it go. I sleep. I sleep! No one seems to be hiring famous poets at this time. So I'm surviving by cold calling businesses to set appointments for an overpriced fax machine salesperson to come pitch them. What was it, Professor Helper? Hmm. Did someone try to con you? Send me a message. Download a virus or it where? Send me a message. Update. Hypnospace has recently started a Hypnospace Patrol Department to try and do we what we've been doing um, for almost a whole year. Do not expect this to actually help anything. Hypnospace only has one care. Money. We haven't, um, n Beans Best Deals Terry yet. Just, uh, Professor Helper. We know that Professor Helper sucks. Is he still real? Yeah, this cunt's still alive. Investigation pending. Remove! Best Deals Terry is offering downloads that have viruses in them. Do not download his sticker or background packs. I do not think he is doing this on purpose. I have contacted him, but he has not responded. You can cure the virus using HypnoCure. Okay, best deals, Terry. <laughs> Good page. Welcome to Terry's General Store. Here you can find all of the highest quality backgrounds, stickers, screen saves, and more, all here in one location. Screen saves. Here at Terry's General Store, we don't mess around, and our deals are better than the other deals. We even My have mouse a is melting. Program that makes it even easier and more fun than ever to install Terry's General Store products. Let me check out these cool stickers. Downloading V Stick Skull. Could this also be a- oh, no, well, this is- it's actually a skull, and I kind of like it. It's going on the desktop. I don't know, I kind of like this Best Deals Terry guy. Seems all right by me. Terry's Outdoors Backgrounds and Sticker Packs. These are expensive. Oppos. Professor Helper. More, more scam shit. Um... World. This oh oh it's oh this dude helped out best deals Terry. Thanks for all the help to Gearhead Greg for getting these stickers for sale. Hmm.
Help me get these thumbs up hands off my page. I only want one. I'm not really seeing anything illegal here. mentioned an installation program. Yeah, I didn't see any of that. Just some sticker- oh, well, well, the garden sticker pack and the jungle pack. It says here, do not download his sticker or background packs. We'll download the sticker and background packs. I have to pay for them. What's the cheapest one? This one. Downloading nine files. Nine files. Virus detected. For your safety, please open HypnoCure and click Cure Me now. What kind of virus is it? Virus detected. For your safety, please open your no cure and click cure me now. Looks like best deals Terry is gonna get fucking slammed in the slammer. Sorry, not like slammed into the slammer. Oh shit. Detected. For your safety, please open hypno cure and click cure me now. All I did was make virus a virus! Detected. For your safety, please open HypnoCure and click Cure Me Now. Is this... How do I get this gone? That's part of your OS? Kind of useful. I can put, um, I can leave April in there. Rest in peace, April, once again. <laughs> Gotta go, mate. Excuse me? What the fuck, Terry? They're in on it, or it's a glitch. Oh, okay. I think I have to download all the packs for this to work. Oh, now it works, okay. Uh, even though I thought I clicked that earlier. No violation detected. Um, the background pack I don't think is fucked. You're clicking the image and not the links? Oh, I see. No violation. Thank <laughs> you. 
I click the text. Oh. Oh, it was opposite of what I thought. Terry, you gotta go! Terry has been flagged. So it says here, um, Hypnospace is a complete mess. There's no specific zone that it tells me to go to. Seems like it's just everywhere. Everywhere is shit. Though it's not that bad. And you got several emails, you only read the most recent one. Oh, that's scrolled all the way up. That's the most recent email. Um, everything else has been... been read. You know what it's time for? Take a guess. Granny creams, hot butter, ice cream. We take the hot butter, mix it with the ice cream. Freeze it up, cool, you can see it on your screen. Put it in your microwave, make it real hot, like a soup or a dip. We call it heat and sip. Very tasty and healthy too. Granny creams, hot butter, ice cream. Delicious. Stand with Gooper. If freedom of speech is taken away, then dumb and silent, we may be led like sheep to the slaughter. Abraham Lincoln. This is not about a cartoon, it's about resisting the erasure of the work of a patriotic hero, a man who was willing to sacrifice everything for his country, W.E. Briggs. We honor his memory and honor America by standing with Cooper. I would laugh if this wasn't pertinent to 2019 and not just 1999 in fake hypnospace. However, you gotta go. Stop! You violated the law! <clears throat> that was bad. <clears throat> yeah. This just in. Local vine sauce decides to take down things that he was once taken down for. I want to thank Good Time Valley community for stepping up, taking action when my freedom of speech was ripped from me. when my freedom of speech was ripped away from me. Thank you. Asterisk my gumshoe Cooper graphics were deleted for content infringement. Last I checked old cartoons are not illegal. Important message received from dispatch. Oh yeah? Important message received? Before I received the message... Violated the law. The lol. You got any other, um, crime? What are your crimes? No more crimes. Oh, this is crimes. Hang on a minute, what's this? Damn it. I'm normally a very relaxed person. It takes a lot to get me angry. Guess what? I'm angry. There's something wrong when a huge company is so ignorant that they allow abusive pages to thrive while, at the same time, tearing down the hard work of hypnospace citizens who are trying to make a positive difference in this place. I had hoped, falsely, that this hypnospace patrol department program would actually be an improvement. The problem Damn. here is that they got a bunch of snot-nosed can't see the forest for the trees 20-year-olds to run the thing. Probably even the same punks who are using hypnospace to harass people. These people do not care about really helping and they just click their buttons and call it a day. I now I know why YouTube flags and claims everything, because it's Instead, fun. It leaves me more stressed out than dealing with a bunch of six-year-olds all day. If things don't change, I'm getting a refund. You hear that? R-E-F-U-N-D. Important message received from dispatch. Do you know how fun it is to use the hammer? I am a YouTube heroes. 
Oh, this is Abby's page. 59 years old. Gotta go again, Abby. Hang on, before I read the email, let me clean up the rest of this horrible infringement. Oh my god. Oh my god! Carl, why do you believe this beef frame bullshit? Big hogs! Get paid, son. All toilet sounds. There's gonna be a crossover of Hank Hill and Captain Picard. Computer, turn off that noise. Fourteen violation points for earning rubber. Terminated. <laughs> you gotta be terminated now, sir. Oh, all right. Rest in peace, Lisa. In memoriam of Lisa, my beloved wife. You settled me down when I thought no one could. You put up with me until I got my act together. You were the most kind woman I met, and you were kind T-O-A-L-L. -L. You are my heart and I can't wait to see you again. I love you, baby. Well, now I feel bad again. Why, Lisa? Why, Lisa? Man, I'm just getting rid of these citizens. This is a classic example of, are we the baddies? I've said, tar I've done and said horrible things on tonight's stream. Well, I don't know, Dutch. I just want to wear some assless chaps. Mob croonies. Are we sure that's that's legal? That's fine. All right. Well, I got rid of the um, the things, and now the leather cowboy shall be flagged. Mr. Sauce, this isn't making me feel good anymore. Can we go back to silly antics? Mm, we could go back to granny cream. Good job out there, Vine, but there's more to clean up. Case added. Right. Well, I think we can... Probably close the case by now. I've gone above and beyond. Great job removing that content infringement. See if you can find more violations on your own. Thanks. Look up the page of that chopper guy, by the way, what happened after Cool Fest 99. Do I want to know about Cool Fest?
The organizers of Pool Fest 99 offer our sincere sympathies to those injured after the Chowder Man set, and wish them a speedy recovery. We will be holding a special event to commemorate the life of Chowder Man. Oh my god. Johnson soon, so please stay tuned. It's like fucking Altamont. Guess who's back? Cuff, my man, my best friend, I've let you down for the last time. Please forgive me, fans and friends, I'm deeply sorry for this tra tragedy. I beg you to have mercy on me. Anguish we feel. Our faithful drummer, 15 years, Cuff Johnson, lost his life. Wow. Me and three fans... Uh, wait, wait, and me and the rest of the band members and three fans on the chowder copter were injured. It all in you can't have that. Guess who's back? I. There is a lip sync thing? Now, let's set the record straight on the lip sync thing. But I not how you think. You see. I nearly queued up the wrong version of the song. I not how you think. The one I meant to queue up didn't have vocals. At the shows this January, you'll only hear the real FRE freezer. Okay, well this isn't exactly death now, is it? There's even a video of the lip sync thing. Let's get the dirt. This event was incredible. Cool Punk is finally dead, folks, and Cool Fest this killed event it. This was incredible. Cool Punk is finally dead, folks, and Cool Fest killed it. From the moment I stepped out of my car onto the, ironically, scorching pavement of the King Amphitheater parking lot, I knew this was going to be special. Sandwiched between two enormous ads for extra thick chips was the Cool Fest ticket window. Waiting patiently in front of it were 200-ish people. Not quite the 5,000-person turnout the Cool Fest planners were hoping for. Here's a highly scientific pie chart of the Cool Fest attendee types. After grabbing our tickets, a venue attendant had us form another line at the opposite end of the venue for our promised Joman merch. Christ. Only the cool punk kids and parents hit this line, with the chowder man people heading inside to get good seats for his opening act. After cool is for nearly an hour for the merch to show up. Opposite of fire. Called our fire fest. Cool fest. Us, knocking a few trash cans over on the way. Some sweaty guy emerged with a single box of Joman keychains. No shirts, and no free Grey's Peak Cola as promised. People were pissed and the keychains were used as projectiles throughout the rest of the evening. Chowder Man had already launched into the Chowder Man's hotel room when me and the gaggle of cool punk kids and parents arrived at the stage. He followed it up with some eight-minute song about shaving, a couple of newer rap rock songs with his new band Cruncher, <laughs> and an encore of an extended version of the Grey's Peak jingle. No one really cared or seemed particularly into his stuff until the Grey's Peak thing. Then it happened. A helicopter landed on a platform in the middle of the crowd, and the band and a few fans from backstage hopped aboard. I was surprised that the thing even made it in safely with all the wires hanging around. As I'm sure you all know, Chowder Man crashed his copter. Old Chowder's leg had to be amputated and their oh drummer died. God. I can't bring myself to be too awful about this because it was harrowing to watch. You'd think they'd call it a night after a helicopter crash, but no. Cool fest continued. An old guy from Gray's Peak, a guy in a Joman costume, and few merchant soft people came up and gave a speech about how amazing and dedicated cool punk fans are and threw a few shirts into the crowd. It would have been weird anyway, but the crash just made it completely surreal to watch. Oh <laughs> fre 3 hit the stage next and played for only 15 minutes before it became clear that he was lip-syncing. The cool punk kids started yelling mild swear words and started throwing their Joman keychains on stage. An old guy came out and told everyone that Cool Fest was over, and that was it. Needless to say, the event exceeded my expectations. Um... Yeah... Yeah... List. Or no comment. If you're a nerd, is currently filling the void that DG Exchange left behind after Merchant Soft banned it. Until recently, people were only using it to post rips of the bad obscure music they listen to, but now the Hypno Space Rabble are sharing passwords, I guess, and it's getting really, really bizarre. Like, do these people get that it's private? Here are a bunch of interesting poems. And here we have, uh, drawings of cars. 
with human heads. Even Chowder Man himself is using it, and, well, just see for yourself. In conclusion, we should probably revoke all Flist passwords and start again. At least they don't know about the NetSettler safe mode thing yet. Nobody tell them please. We need, um, we need music stat. Any, do you think this is a reference to Woodstock 99? I think it's a reference to several things all at once, but yeah. Well, yeah, that was, that was kind of fucked. Let's continue to look for more crimes. Oh, actually, you know what? We should find out what Zane's been up to. Zane engages in harassment. God, are we still doing this badge? All this stuff is back up again. Yeah, the dude didn't even change his status. I mean, this is all... just back to the way it was. Flag it for investigation. Zane, I think, is is just fine. The news is true. I dumped my girlfriend. It just did not work out. Also, I don't like squishers anymore. It's for kids. I like gory movies a lot. New comic up. My best one yet. It's... I used to run a cool, hilarious page here, but it got shut down because Hypnospace couldn't handle the jokes. Too sensitive, like seven-year-olds. Seepage is the best band in the flippin' world. Stupid website award the dumpster. The worst Hypnospace page. <laughs> <laughs> award goes to the dumpster. More like the dumpster. No surprise here, for it is probably written by a fruity fairy 30-year-old who lives with his mommy. I don't think he could handle the... the yeah, I, I think he, he thought the cool... The cool stuff on the dumpster was, was like, happy. And he, then he, now he realizes it's bad. It's not happy, it's bad. Okay, so here's the comic. Psst, hey, numb nuts over here. Wait, why can I click that? I can click the nuts. Weird. Don't scream. Yes, I am powerful, but I am a good guy. Come on. Come outside now, Zane. Walla. I'm Mikey Psyche. The bottom of the page, he flamed you. I gotta go back to it. We've been watching you, Zane. Come into my energy portal only if you can handle it. Let's go! A few minutes later, practice stage, training zone. Elite training only. Game zone. This place is freaking huge. Yes, it's the biggest secret base in the galaxy. Welcome to the Steel Sewer. We have every single gun. Machine gun. Machine gun. Sword and RPG in the world. We have every instrument, every video game and movie. There's even a soda machine. But for now, we must talk. Those dreams you had, they're all real. The demons, the green energy, the secret powers and double pistols. All of it's real. We need your help, Zane. There is an evil force at stake in this world. Most people are blind to its power, but we have been fighting it for 20 years. Some reason, Zane. For some reason, it is scared of you. It knows you have a secret power. And if you train and unlock the power, it knows that you can kill it. Let's kick some demon ass. Hey Vine, did I tell you you could scroll down all the way down? Oh, oh. Um, I don't think this works. For, no, you can't. That's fine. 
Oh, that, that was harassment. This has graphic imagery. I don't know. I don't know if I would claim the whole comic. I don't know, I heard something about double pistols. Alright, well that's the best I could do there. Hypnospace Heaven by Abby Wrights. A sacred place. Welcome to heaven. Welcome to Hypnospace Heaven. This is Page is a sacred space where the memories of those who have passed may live on. Namast. Namast? Bill, I love you more than you will ever know. You were the best friend and husband God gave me. The Corkies are still not a good team and I hate them. Miss you, my love. Abby. Boy, didn't I just nuke Abby into fucking oblivion? What was the girlfriend's page? People said go to go to his girlfriend's page. It's like Jessica's page, right? Yeah. Oh, it's Teen Zone. What am I doing? Teen Topia, right? I love Zane. We've broken up. He's still handsome and smart, but I don't like him anymore. We just broke up tonight. He's awesome and his comics are incredible, but it just didn't work out because I'm too scared of horror movies and he likes to watch those all the time. It's not made by Zane. Did he get a fucking... Did he get a proxy? It's the same IP. Oh, right, right, right. It was the same IP because she's from Pittsburgh. I forgot about the same IP thing, yeah. Hypnospace right before bed. Don't hypnospace before bed, everyone. Take my advice. Update. Please stop putting the Gumshoe Cooper cartoon on your pages. Thanks. Thanks. Scotty. Hi, I am Mr. Old Fashioned. I am happy to be the community leader for Good Time Valley even though I don't know why they picked me. I think it's because I have good behavior, but that is because I don't ever use hypno space other than for listening to songs HAJ. If you are having trouble you can contact me, but I am sometimes busy and I'm also not on hypno space every night. Well, but Scotty. Haha. Uh -huh. This stuff just seems so wholesome. Ho wholesome. <laughs> oh man, that sucks. Free trials ended. Poor citizen. There's a lot of good content on this page. Did this person die? Oh no, okay. doing this.
Abigail. Please stop. We all love Sandy, and she has helped us all so much with her love and support, but now is the time for action. We need a leader with the courage to stand against this attack on our faith and values, and Southern Gent RR is that person. Endorsed by Gumshoe Gooper himself? <laughs> Damn it. That's like seeing- that's like saying I'm endorsed by Mickey Mouse. Hello my loves. Please don't take this as me being against you all but I think we should not be putting the Gumshoe Cooper cartoons on our page if W.E. Briggs Estate doesn't want us to. It doesn't seem like Merchant Soft are lying about this one. Hmm. You did it. You figured it out. Humor picture gallery, please. B.W.L. Burst with laughter, everybody. Maybe this is the B.W.L. emote right here. Note to enforcers. I have removed all Gumshoe Gooper images from this page. I do not blame you for just doing your job. My husband was a security officer for many years and he knew what it was like when people were rotten to him for just doing his duty. Thank you for your service. I can get it on Franker Face. If you guys want a BWL, I can get it for you. Just um, submit them emotes on the Buru, you know? Check out the, the emote submission page and we'll figure something out. If you want to get me um, one of these or... Something similar. I don't know. I mean, it's a little redundant to have a, a yellow smiley with that face, considering they already exist. It's it's too generic. We need something a little bit better than that. But whatever you do, don't submit Gumshoe Gooper. Note: Is Detective Frank still okay? He's from the same cartoon as Gumshoe Gooper, but maybe he isn't popular enough. Just tell me, and I will take it down. Don't you just love Mondays? Oh, it's hilarious. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, I guess he's fine. Kid, there's no such thing as a grumpy old man. When you get older, you stop being polite and start being honest. Hilarious. I am a retired elementary school guidance counselor and board of education member. Even though my work is done, I love to contribute to the communities I live in, both the online and real-life varieties. If you ever need anything, do not hesitate to send me a message. I always respond. Love y'all. If I may be so bold, the dumpster page should be shut down. I don't know how they get away with tearing people down all the time. Arlen, your artwork is awesome. Don't listen to these spoiled punks who wouldn't know good art if it bit them in the behind. If they were any good they wouldn't hide their page like slimy little cowards. That's nice grandma. Finally, brothers and sisters. No granny cream, but it's alright. Whatever is noble, whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is admirable. If anything is excellent or praiseworthy, think about such things. Philippians 4, 8. Unfortunately, my fellow good timers don't want me to be the leader anymore because of this Cooper thing. I still love y'all, but I can't go along with this war you're all fighting. I hope we can repair our friendships though and once again be hypnospace friends. Oh well, shit. More, more expired content. Abigail started a war. Yeah, I know. I know. Fucking Abigail. Here we go. I'm still missing two squishers. Oh, 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 love squid. It's the daylight saving squid, everybody. You can pet it, feed it, love it. And it farts. Wait.
Whose page had the thing about, oh, Beef Brain is a hoax, so let me see this. Hello, my friends. I understand that some of you are concerned that hypnospace can hurt your brain. And who knows, maybe it can, but I have to say that this Beef Brain thing is very suspicious. If you look at the bottom of the Beef Brain main page, it says something about mechs. If I remember right, these are the same hooligans who pulled the explosive headband prank and had half of you put that horrible, horrible song on your page in order to prevent your head from blowing up. <laughs> if the hypnospace headband is unhealthy, it's I probably just because it makes you tired and not some crazy brain disease. Love, Sandy. At least it's not something like, you know, putting a fucking light bulb in a microwave to see it light up. You know, that's, that's not something you ever want to do, but some people did that because they got told, and let's not talk about making crystals. People are both malicious and gullible. But beef brain is absolutely real. Galicious? That's a new word. You did it. Cool fucking pet. How do I kill this pet? Eat, eat it, eat the donut, eat it. I see that. Yeah, you could. I could get rid of it if I wanted to. I'm gonna call daylight savings squid. Or <laughs> DSL <laughs> for short. Wait. Fuck. Here, I'll we'll compromise. I think I have beef brain. Cool Punk is dead, rip. I didn't really spend a lot of time exploring these pages. Day Savings Light, that's exactly right. And capitalism killed it. Cool Punk has fallen. Those who would seek to exploit and profit from it are the true killers. They have not stopped. Still, they feed on. It's rotting corpse. It's amazing how... Like, random, generic, white dude with a little bit of facial hair is immediately me. I don't have a V for Vendetta facial, uh, hair patch, soul beard. I don't have... That is me. Downloading FRE3s or sucks. <laughs> no, I don't have a soul beard, everybody. So when you go to PAX East and you, you want to meet me, if I don't look exactly like that, it's not me. It's an imposter. I just want you to know, so if you see someone that looks a little bit different than that, it's not me and, and it's all fake. An imposter, if you will. Never mind the lip-syncing sellout. Forget the helicopter crash. August of 1999 marked the real nail in the coffin of Cool Punk. The corralling of hypnospace users into sponsored zones damaged more communities than just ours, but unlike those groups, ours cannot exist under corporate overseers. Corporate. Cool Punk isn't an ideal anymore. It's a brand. 
They've identified what makes us US and are selling it back to us through advertising partnerships and an array of worthless digital products. Wendy's memes, anyone? Products coated in the blood of cool punk. We can, of course, continue to inhabit this hijacked shell of a world. If we're more devoted to symbols of freedom, even those of our own design, than freedom itself, we deserve our hollow existence here. I saw a really bad one recently. And it was just everyone was ragging on them, but I don't remember what it was. It was a corporate meme on Twitter. It was just a couple days ago. It wasn't Arby's. Arby's is, is fucking particularly bad with the memes. It was so, like... Oh, man. God, God. Stop farting. Stop shitting. It was so, like, tone deaf. I couldn't believe it. But... Me not believing it also means I guess I don't remember it. However, Cool Punk is alive and well. Dead. That's funny. Last I checked, Jan is about to go on a worldwide tour. Also, FRE3ZER was not lip singing. In the video, it's obviously a special effect on the voice, so they had to record it ahead of time. If you brats keep behaving this way, companies are going to go back to ignoring us. It's just not worth it for them. Lay off people. <laughs> special effect. Um, someone said. Was it the gamer dress? I uh, know it wasn't the gamer dress that makes you look like a gaming chair. Um, there was another one. Buffalo wings telling people to get vasectomies. What? Support FRE3ZER. I bought his single six times. Can you do better? Wow. Cool Fest was amazing. Chowder Man and his new band Cruncher played a great set that even a teenager like me could get into. And then FRE3s are killed IT with his amazing new songs. All of the Freak Ray's Peak merchandise was great, and I even got an autograph. What a totally sweet trip. Chill it, right? Chillin'. I see Bia. FRE3ZER is back and he revealed his identity. I just knew he was going to be a cutie. I'm obsessed. If you like FRE3s or and Ray's Peak Cola too, add me on Chit Chat. Let's talk. Those eyes. Welcome to the official Vlinny fan page. Oh, that's me too. Yeah, yeah, that's me. But it's Vlinny because it's it's ice. These two songs are totally killer. Chill it right and icy girl are so stuck in my head. I am seeing him in concert at Cool Fest 99, so I will do a concert report later. Meet me there. Five pick stars, perfect. Yes, if you heard his older music and thought it was weird, definitely give this new stuff a chance. It totally rips. It made me totally go WITW in a good way. Buffalo Wild Wings did put out a vasectomy ad. I'm all for vasectomies, everybody. I'd like to let you know Vine Sauce as a brand supports vasectomies. The old vine sauce vasectomy, you know about it. You know how Nathan, maybe some of you guys know this, but Nathan Fielder has a page. This, I don't know why this reminded me of it, but Nathan Fielder, in one of his episodes of Nathan For You, um, created a jacket. You know what? Not even gonna go into it. But it, you know what? Summit Ice. It, yeah, it's it's good because on his page, it, it also um, is good. Alright, let's stop there. No, I don't know how to explain it. My brain is brain rotted tonight, and so I won't be able to explain it well, and it's just going to come off poorly. Watch the episode. Just, just watch the Summit Ice episode of Nathan for you. Never in all my year of being a student of school, one I expect that Ari Greasy ER was disappointed. I was in the front row at Cool Fest 99, and let me tell you, this guy was a total hack. He's totally making it on my fake Cool Punks page. He was fake playing the keyboard and fake singing every song, even before the lip singing video. The high point of Cool Fest was Chowder Man crashing his copter and killing she crappy drummer, Sima. 
other pages so many of these pages are just a shit show zero slash ten then you gulp it down I am pretty baby cough it down those are the lyrics I love seeing all the incredible things you all make the song playing now is my spoken word interpretation of the Grey's Beat song. I remember hearing that song so many times on the commercials in between the early morning cartoons back in the 80s when I was a little girl. So much nostalgia. It is my first cool punk work. I hope you will check out my other work too, which you can find at the homepage link at the top of this page. SY is there copyright? What's the infringerinos? I don't see any infringerinos here. The IRL copyright song? I don't think that was exactly the one. It's, uh, my squid is sad here. You're good now, right? We good? We good. See? We good. Feed him. No. Oh, no, 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 no. HypnoCure Pro is a scam? Net Settler. Support for Net Settler pages or else. Update. No, I will not be paying your exorbitant HypnoCure Pro fee just to be able to load my own page properly. Clicking a safe mode button every time a page loads is not an enjoyable way to browse HypnoSpace. Look at what you did to my page with your newest update. What's well, your own goddamn fault? <laughs> Wait, is it? Someone said, remember when people got mad at Firefox for not having Netscape support. I don't remember that. But good parody. So here's the beef brain again. Um, I'm not finding a whole lot of other infractions. Vinny, this page was all gibberish last time you came through. I do remember gibberish. Yeah, it says there's more out there to clean up. I mean, we could go to some previous offenders. Like, um, who- who was the, um... Again, with the farts. Um... J Sherry! Exorcism client? Testimony? We read that one. What, what's your services, Sherry? Sherry's berries? Please chit-chat me. I can't. Also, for good Hypnospace page, look at my friend's page, Temple of Serenity. It's great. Alright, yeah, here's the exorcism. Chit-chat at Cherry Heels. Enter your password. Can I download Chit Chat yet?
Denver Computers, 1970. <laughs> the entered password is similar to more than one password on file, but doesn't match any of them. Please try again. All the Gallo. Sorry, all the Gallo. 62 years old. Asbury Park, New Jersey. You know, I saw the Pixies live at uh, Asbury Park. It's quite nice over there. Use her info as the password. So, like, let's say you live in Denver, you're 29, and your favorite hobby is computers. So it would be like, um, I don't know. Asbury Park used to be a shit show. I know, they fixed it up, though. They made it really nice. Asbury Park. Maybe Asbury Psychic. Shit. Holy shit. You know what this calls for? Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Took a little too long to get that, but all right, fine. Okay, uh, multiple plans for you to choose from. HSPD, please, I need to survive. This is my only way I can pay my rent. Don't remove this, please. I paid you good money to be in hypnospace. Healing session, huh? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know about them healing sessions. Gotta be, gotta be honest. Cool. Get rid of it and then fart. Crap. Candle lit for you or a loved one. Oh yeah, you're gonna light a candle for me for only ten dollars? Important message received from dispatch. God fucking damn it, Sherry. H. We've been letting these weird payment processors slip lately because it's been so hectic around here. Added a case so you can close it and cash in. New case, unauthorized software. Mil malicious software notice regarding unauthorized speed boosting software reported in Starpoint Castle Dream Station. Oh, this is a whole new thing. A new zone for all you geeks, nerds, and other citizens with niche interests. Ah, yes. God. God of the, the, the necklaces. Gods of the necklaces. Well, to be continued. Gamers! 
Welcome to Starport Castle Dream Station, a new zone where fans of fantasy, science fiction, and other niche interests may converge. If your listed pages appeared in one of the following zones, they have now been relocated here. Sci-Fi Starport, Gamers Only, The Comic Shop, The Dream Castle, Cybercog Station. Important say say cog again. Soft. Can you say cog again, please? It seems the passwords of multiple merchants off personnel have been recently compromised. Please change your password immediately. <laughs> Especially if you have access to our code base. Well, how the fuck do you do that? joke because of that one site? Okay. Vinny, you're squid. Oh good, we get to watch it die. Pimo. You're gonna be okay. Here lies April. Here lies DSL Squid. Vinny, you've killed two pets with your negligence. Make no mistake, the Squid's death was not negligence. Alright, uh, I think we have to stop here. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Alright, next time I stream this, we'll put a little bit more time into it. It's such an easy game to get lost in. It's, it's great.